welcome. We're back for another West Live. Glad you guys are taking a little time off of your busy week to just take some time to worship and uh, to give God his praise. Uh, he is indeed worthy, isn't he, of the praises that we bring as his people. What a mighty God. What an awesome God all-powerful, all-loving, and he looks to us, calls us his own. He forgives, he cleanses, he gives us new hope, he gives us new direction. He is worthy, my friends, of the praises we bring. So we're going to spend some time tonight just doing that, just giving him his praises. Here we go. What a wonderful change in my life has been wrought since Jesus came into my heart. I have light in my soul for which long I have sought since Jesus came into my heart. Since Jesus came into my heart since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy, oh my soul Like the sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart I have ceased from my wandering And going astray Since Jesus came into my heart and my sins, which were many, are all washed away Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy o'er my soul Like the sea billows roll since Jesus came into my heart There's a light in the valley of death now for me Since Jesus came into my heart And the gates of the city beyond I can see Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy, oh my soul Like the sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart I shall go there to dwell In that city I know Since Jesus came into my heart and I'm happy, so happy as onward I go Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy o'er oh my soul Like the sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart I'm possessed of a hope that is steadfast and sure Since Jesus came into my heart And no dark clouds of doubt now my pathway obscure Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Floods of joy o'er my soul Like the sea billows roll Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Since Jesus came into my heart Amen since Jesus came into my heart. Testimony time, right? It's time to just, uh, you, you do, do you remember the day that happened for you? You know, it's been neat watching, watching news lately and, 
and hearing uh, some of these uh, famous artists, music artists, and sports players. And if you watch the the uh, uh, World Series, uh, baseball players, and others who are professing faith in Jesus Christ and uh, giving Him glory for who they are and what they've gotten and how God has moved in their lives and how He has filled a hole that was there that they couldn't fill with alcohol and sex and all of the other stuff that life says is fulfilling. But Jesus, now there, there's something that matters, right? Uh, he comes in and He touches lives. And He does it sometimes through people. Uh, he draws us to Himself by bringing us into relationship with people who love Him. I mean, He did that for me. Uh, one of the places where that happened was in my home and remembering the times when uh, my mother and my dad were just going through life and they just lived their faith, that's all. They just lived it and we watched it. And it caught. I love them. They've both been gone now for about three years. And I don't have a day go by, I don't think about them. I don't remember. Precious memories. How they linger. How they ever flood my soul. In the stillness of the midnight, precious sacred scenes unfold. Precious memories, unseen angels. Sent from somewhere to my soul How they linger ever near me And the sacred past unfold Precious Father, loving Mother, fly across the lonely years, and old home scenes of my childhood in fond memory appears precious memories unseen angels sent from somewhere to my soul how they linger The sacred past unfold. In the stillness of the midnight, echoes from the past I hear. Time singing, gladness bringing from.
on that lovely land somewhere. Precious memories, unseen angels sent from somewhere to my soul. How they linger ever near me And the sacred past unfold As I travel on life's pathway I know not what the years may hold As I ponder Hope grows fonder Precious memories flood my soul Precious memories Unseen angels Sent from somewhere to my soul How they linger ever near me And the sacred past unfolds Memories are precious, aren't they? You just go back and uh, you can remember some stuff that wasn't so good, too. Because Dad wasn't perfect. <laughs> but guess what? <laughs> Neither am I. None of us are. But it's those times when we touch one another, when we just reach out and have time for one another, when we love one another and become family. That, that, that's special. Those memories will always be there. Thinking particularly about mom and dad this, this night, because like I said, it was three years ago in August for mom and in November for dad. So this is the anniversary month of his death. And, you know, he was a special man. He was one of the World War II generation. He grew up in the days of the Depression. He was born right before the Depression. Things were tough for their family in Mississippi. And uh, when he was 13 years old, he had to leave home because they couldn't afford to feed him. He traveled across country as a 13-year-old, went all the way to Oregon, where he signed up with... uh, CCC camp, Conservative Conservation Corps. I'm not sure what all he built, but he worked alongside others, helping to try to stay alive. He'd work and then he'd send his money home for his mom and dad and the kids that were left there. When he was 16 years old, he lied to get into the military because It was uh, the days of World War II, and he went into the Navy as a CB. You know, he never talked about that much. He said a few things toward the end of his life, but most of his life he never said a word. And I think it was because the memories were too painful of those days. I I can't begin to imagine what it must have been like. But he came back from war and God reached out and touched him and gave him uh, a new beginning. 
And I remember the songs, testimony songs, were his favorite to sing. And he would stand in the pulpit with his old Gibson L7 guitar. And he would sing. He would just, sometimes even you would see a, a misty eye as he would sing songs like this one. I would love to tell you what I think of Jesus Since I found in Him a friend so strong and true I would tell you how He changed my life completely He did something that no other man could do no one ever cared for me like Jesus. There's no other friend so kind as he. No one else could take the sin and darkness from me. Oh, how much he cared for me. All my heart was full of sin when Jesus found me. All my heart was full of misery and woe. Jesus placed his strong and loving arms around me and he led me in the way I ought to go No one ever cared for me like Jesus There's no other friend so kind as he No one else could take the sin and darkness from me Oh how much he cared for me Every day he comes to me with new assurance More and more I understand his words of love But I'll never know just why he came to save me I see his blessed face above No one ever cared for me Like Jesus There's no other friend so kind as he No one else could take the sin and darkness from me How much he cared for me. Dad loved those. He loved singing it. He loved being able to know that he was actually one who benefited from what Jesus had done for him. Matter of fact, uh, he, not long after his conversion to Christianity, he sat down and wrote a song. He may have written more, but this is the only one that I remember him having written. Um, and again, it's a, it's a testimony song. And uh, he, he loved singing. He just, you know, he just, there was something about this song that because it came from his heart that was especially 
uh, important to him. He wanted this message out. He wanted people to know the difference that Jesus can make. So, so he wrote this one. Once I was lost in the darkness of sin My life was filled with strife Then I heard a sweet voice speak to my heart Surrender to Him your life Oh look to Christ, He paid the price He died for you and for me he will help you, he'll carry you through If only on him you believe Oh, what joy swept o'er my soul My heart was filled with peace As I knelt at the cross, that need was filled so pure and sweet Oh look to Christ He paid the price He died for you and for me He will help you He'll carry you through If only on Him you Turn him away, don't make him wait outside. Oh, look to Christ, he paid the price, died for you and for me. He will help you, he'll carry you. carry you through if only on him you believe that one was for you dad Thanks for writing it. Ah, well, I want to thank you for joining me tonight, taking time to, to just worship the Lord. I don't know, there's something, something refreshing about it, I think. Just to uh, let the words live. Let it be more than just a song. But let it speak to your heart. And let it call you deeper. And then one day, you know, the thing that, that gives me peace in all of this is the knowledge that uh, is sitting all, that there's going to be a day when I don't know if he got his L7 to heaven or not. I don't think so. So maybe, maybe there'll be a, a, an old guitar up there. Maybe the one David, maybe the harp David used when he was playing for King Saul. I don't know. But I can, st I can see him serenading the angels. And, uh, and one day, I'm going to see him again. See Mama. See family members who have gone on ahead. 
frankly, that gives me a great deal of peace and a great deal of hope. And this is a song that just reminds us of that fact that there's going to be a day when we will meet again. God be with you till we meet again. By his counsel's guide uphold you With his sheep securely fold you God be with you till we meet again Till we meet Till we meet Till we meet at Jesus' feet Till we meet, till we meet God be with you Till we meet again God be with you till we meet again. Neath his wings securely hide you. Daily manna still provide you. God be with you till we meet again. Till we meet feet till we meet till we meet God be with you till we meet again God be with you till we meet again when life's perils thick confound you Put his arms unfailing round you God be with you till we meet again God be with you till we Keep love's banner floating o'er you Smite death, smite death's threatening wave before you God be with you till we meet again Till we meet God be with you till we meet again. Thank you for joining us. I want to remind you that uh, we need your prayers. God is a faithful God, and he is a 
God who meets our needs. He is a God who fills us up and wants us to pour ourselves out on others. When he gives us a blessing, it is not one that he calls upon us to keep, but he wants us to give it away. And if we don't give it away, we lose it. So it's just the way God's economy works. So give your love to someone as you walk through your life. Pray for this ministry, would you? We need your prayers. We're headed off uh, this weekend to Elgin, Texas, where we will be sharing in ministry there down close to Austin. Pray for us that God would use us to touch lives in that community. Reverend Blanco is there, and he is a faithful disciple and follower of Jesus. And so I'm excited to be working with him. Be in prayer for the Methodist Church as well, would you? Uh, It looks like we are in very perilous days. Uh, I am a part of the Wesleyan Covenant Association, a group of Methodists who hold to traditional Orthodox views of the Bible and its teachings. And uh, there's much to be prayed about and for as we come towards the next general conference in 2020. So pray. We can do that, can't we? Do you believe God can make a difference? I do. I do. And um, pray about becoming a part of our financial support. We need your help. Uh, We're coming up towards uh, November and December when bookings tend to fall off and uh, we need uh, support through those days. And matter of fact, The offerings that we receive at the end of the year are very important for our sustaining through the rest of the year. So pray about that. We would love to have you. You can can actually give online at uh, wesleyputnam.org slash give. wesleyputnam.org slash give. And we would just be so honored if you would uh, choose to use part of your second mile giving to help this ministry and keep us strong. So uh, thank you again for being with us. And we will look forward to doing this again next Friday around 8. All right? 8-ish. Remember, that's the way this works. 8-ish. So anyway, God bless you and keep you. Make his face to shine upon you and give you his peace. Amen.